Healthcare disparities continue to exist along racial lines in the United States. Not only that, but we see that nurses and nursing students also face discrimination entirely based on their race. With all the turmoil facing our country as a result of the murder of George Floyd, I think now is a good time for us to look at our profession and investigate how we can improve that. In one study by the National Institute of Health, they found that mortality rates were 20% higher among people of color, resulting in a four-year decrease in life expectancy. And then 43% of cases that they looked at, there was a decreased quality of care. This all led to disproportionate burden of illness completely along racial lines. And in one state they looked at, in fact, with uh, patients who were discharged from the hospital with peripheral ar 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 arterial disease, in fact, they looked at 800,000 discharges. And they found that African Americans specifically were 77% more likely to have a limb amputation during their hospital stay. 77% more likely. Now they couldn't attribute this to, to or they weren't, there, there was no attribution to the severity of the illness or anything like that. All they could attribute it to in their studies were racial disparities. You guys, this is something that exists in our profession. And in fact, um, the Nightingale Pledge, the very first publication of the Nightingale Pledge, Florence Nightingale, let me read one line to you from that. And let me read it here. It says, I shall be loyal to my work and devoted towards the welfare of those committed to my care. I shall be loyal to my work and devoted towards the welfare of those committed to my care. I want to challenge everybody listening to this. To those who know that these disparities exist, call them out. Be a part of a solution that ensures that every patient committed to our care has equal health outcomes. To those who don't believe that racial disparities exist, I challenge you to dig deeper. I challenge you to look. I challenge you to read the research. I challenge you to ask coworkers and classmates who are of color and just ask them. In fact, we posted on our Instagram just a couple minutes ago, if uh, students or nurses have ever, ever experienced discrimination or racial inequalities uh, in their role as a nurse or a nursing student. And the results were immediate that yes, 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 they experience it. Whether it's in things that professors say or patients yelling at them and screaming at them because of the color of their skin or even worse, actually seeing it happen to patients. This is something that we cannot tolerate as nurses. I've always looked at nursing as the last great ones, the last great ones of society. That when, when everything breaks down, when all goes wrong, people can look to us as nurses, as those who are going to care for everyone regardless of anything. And we must apply that, especially right now, as race is such a, a, a big topic right now with everything that's going on. I think it's critical that we look internally at our profession and that we acknowledge the problems that exist, whether that's racial discrimination with our coworkers or our classmates, or whether it's actual healthcare disparities with our patients. We acknowledge them. We can't fix the problem unless we acknowledge it. These problems exist, and I ask you, I plead with you, to be a part of a solution to change this. We can do better. We can always, always, always do better. As nurses, we care for the communities in which we live. We care for the communities in which we work. That's why we all took community health nursing. We can't escape, and we can't ignore the community issues uh, that exist. And right now, race is a huge community issue that we must address, we must confront. And I want to challenge again all of you who might think that maybe there isn't a problem, that you spend some time, look at the research, talk to your classmates, talk to your patients, and ask. Simply ask, have you ever experienced racism or discrimination because of the color of your skin? And you will see that this is a problem. And then accept the mantle of being a nurse, that we must take care of all those committed to our care. 
And for those who have experienced it, whether it's as a patient, as a nurse, or as a student, I'm sorry. We can do better, we will do better. We will improve this. We will work together and we will rise to this pledge, this Nightingale Pledge of taking care of all patients committed to our care. And we will be the great ones as nurses. We are an incredible profession and we are part of solutions. We will push forward as nurses. We love you guys. Please be safe, uh, all of you everyone who's part of the nursing family, please be safe and please be fair. Please take care of everyone. We love you guys. Happy nursing.